news or the latest in weather. We'll send it back over to the desk. All right, Zach, thanks. Well, those cooler temperatures at night mean the fall leaves will be crunching under our feet very soon. Yesterday, we looked ahead at how cool the, the new season will get with West Virginia State Climatologist. Now, Zach and 7 News reporter Colin Roos tell us if our autumn is expected to be as rainy as the summer was. Are we in for clear autumn days or gloomy fall rainstorms? It's not clear just yet, but the Mountain State Climatologist says dry days may be on tap for the new season. Summer has not been kind to the Mountain State. Charleston saw its all-time rainiest summer this year, while Huntington had its second rainiest July, only outdone by 2021. But after flooding on top of flooding, things could be airing out for fall, with the National Weather Service's prediction of lower than average rainfall. Hey, I'll take quiet actually for all, because this summer has really been kind of brutal for us, I mean, with all the rain. As of today, we're already halfway through September, so more than likely we've already sweated through our last heat wave. And now we're headed into the driest time of the entire year. We just expect things to kind of quiet down normally, you know, as you go through the end of September to October. I think we're going to try to trend that way, provided the hurricane season stays on the quiet side. Those hurricanes can have a big effect on our weather. If you're wondering why we haven't heard about any big storms making landfall this year, so are meteorologists. September 10th was the peak of hurricane season and only five storms have been named so far. But if one comes along, look out because all bets are off. All it would take would be one, let's say, hit the, the Carolina coast, move inland toward West Virginia. All of a sudden you've got a, a week perhaps of below normal temperature due to the cloudiness and very wet conditions. A stormier pattern usually returns for our area toward the end of November. As for whether we'll see a white Thanksgiving or a white Halloween, that hasn't been happening in recent years. Dr. Law says Superstorm Sandy in 2012 was the last time some real fall snow was pushed our way. It looks like that window of when you get that snowfall over the winter is, is more compressed. Well into December sometimes when we get like any measurable uh, snowfall. Autumn will officially begin with the equinox on September 22nd. So find time to go get a pumpkin or three and get ready for the red and orange wonderland to form all around us. Reporting in Huntington, I'm Colin Roos, working for you. Doesn't he do